ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? My name is DJ A9ZT, and we're back with WWE Champions, and finally, another Hot Tags video, and today, we got Eric with the Hot Tag, and uh, I got Eric from the Viking Raiders, still on my account, thank you Scopely for the opportunity to get to demo him a little bit, and play around with him, and show him to you guys, but uh, I did want to change this a bit, put this finisher back in right here, and uh, running on the hot tag, this is what I'm looking at right here. The knee strike, the exploder suplex, and the running knee. Um, triple black just it didn't make a lot of sense for the hot tag video. Um, if I had a strap on him and I could put like a max black, flat black move damage metal on him and put 50k on all these black moves, I would probably do that then. But with this, uh, I kind of need the running knee just in case. But we're going to look at his entourage for the hot tag here. I got Matt Hardy for the multiply gems to be strength four. And Titus for the choose move to give me seven black gems. And we're going to kind of hope to fill the red move on collateral. Now, the reason I got Lacey is just for collateral gem damage. Because I don't have a black gem damage coach. So 20% more to purple and green. And 15% more for red gems for Typhoon there on any collateral damage we get. Now, I'm going to be setting him up with Scott Hall. Um, I can't just use anybody to set him up. i got to kind of go through who I have. Now, who could fill black? Hall can fill black. So, I'm running Hall with the toothpick flick. So, I'm making row break gems every turn. That's going to play into it, too. I'm hoping to leave a lot of row break gems on the board for Eric. I'm doing the abdominal stretch so we can hold him down with the sub. And the Outsider's Edge, because I could fill Black Gems with that. And uh, I'm using Bray to make sure I get that quick sub, because I don't want to get... Uh, I'm going against Razar first, so I don't want him to put me in a sub early. And I got Sarge for more Road Drake... Road Drake... Road Break Gems. I got Cena on here, same thing, Collateral Gem Damage, 15%. And I got 6, just in case I get caught in that sub by Razar. By some fluke, uh, I can handle that, so... I left all the other gem damage on Eric because we're focusing on the hot tag. Now, I'm going to tell you up front, he's not a spectacular hot tag, okay? He's not going to blow you away. He's not coming in and ending it on the first turn. But he has been effective. I've ran through three different movesets now practicing this. And he's been effective holding his own while he's out there putting the damage out. And then Hall can come back in and finish. So it almost, like, he takes the tag, gives Hall a little breather and uh make sure he fills them black gems back up really quickly and then hall comes back in and takes care of business from there and i got that extra turn uh booster on scott hall there so i'm gonna go ahead and put these down and since he's not gonna be full here i'm gonna go ahead and hit the finisher early and use this to try and fill some gems up Let's go here. No. Here. Because I want to fill black and red. So I need to make sure I catch all these red gems too. Close on red. Close on red now. Problem is with Hall, sometimes like... It takes you quite a bit of turns to earn your tag out because you constantly uh, pin him or submit him like every turn. So he's got purple ready. We don't want to take that one. So we're going to go ahead, put the sub down. Now the sub's going to leave row break gems too. So I'm really hoping to leave row break gems on the board in good positions and a lot of black gems for Eric on the tag in. Now, when I first was doing this, I was having dude love on there for 30% black gem damage, but... It just wasn't getting it done, and I really felt like I'm going to be better with more black gems to do things with. So we're going to get the red filled up here for sure. He's going to have his tag ready, but that's okay. We kind of figured that was going to happen. Let's just go ahead and make sure we get red now. So red's full. He's still not ready. I'm going to go ahead and put the finisher down with Hall. We're not doing 950k damage with Eric, that's for sure. But I don't necessarily want to take all the black gems now. And I don't want to take all these row break gems. So let's just do something safer towards the top here. <coughs> Okay, now Eric's all ready to go. 
and he's got a buffer. If you notice, Akum's three, four turns off a hit unless he gets a good match. So let's go ahead. A lot more roast. Stay up top. Yeah, we need the board spread out. Okay, now let's see what we can do here. Let's see what we can do here. Uh, four black gems to modify. Obviously, I'm going to take this one in the corner because it looks like I'll be able to clip this bottom row easily. And this top row doesn't have anything there, so I'm going to go ahead. Well, let's see. Or do I use this to... Yeah, never mind. We're going we're gonna to keep them all on that side. So now I'm going to go ahead and hit the choose move. Because more than likely, this is going to fill the other black move back up. It's going to fill Hall the way back up. And then I can use the finisher next turn. So there, we got a column break. That's going to go down, clip that other times four. It's going to hit the row break, go across, hit that times four. Now I can play around with blowing up some more stuff on the board. Now I can play around. And I got three row breaks over here. That'll clip all of those. And we can just put an extra black gem in the middle of the bottom there. Let's see what we got. Eric with the hot tag. Blow it up, baby. 302,000 baseline. Got nerfed down to 196. And uh, Akum still wants some more. So, but now both black moves are full, remember. And we've taken no damage. And both the Authors of Pain are starting to hurt a little bit. So... <coughs> oh that was silly i should have put him on these ones over here that was real silly that's my bad could have been better there could have been better there i should have been about 150 instead of 96 oh akum still wants to do battle here he still wants to do battle and hall's not ready yet so Either way, doesn't matter that we missed those on the last one. I can still clip these times fours right here. Boom, we got all of them right there. And uh, we'll just take all of those right there too. Let's just do that. Put some damage down, baby. And he's full up again. And he's full up. Look at the Cascades. Look at the 289 on that one. Now Hall's ready to go. I got both dudes pretty charged up here. Doesn't look like Razar has anything charged. He probably does, though. No, he didn't. All right, so... Uh, Eric's just doing some collateral damage here with the black move. And we're just going to go ahead and uh, tag Hall in. We did what we needed to do. Like I told you, middle of the road in the match... He did what he needed to do. He put a lot of damage down on those dudes. He got my main dude ready to go again. And he got out of dodge. So let's go ahead and slap this sub down here. We don't even want to get hit with that blue move right now. Let's see if we can get him right here. What are we going to get here? I don't have a lot of black gems to work with here. What you kind of need to do with this is use like one black gem, use your three, you make a column break and clip a bunch of row breaks. Looks like my best bet is just staying over here and hitting three. Let's just hit these three instead. And he's back to Akum. Which one of you wants it? <coughs> we haven't even had a we haven't even had an extra turn with Scott Hall yet, so that's probably coming up here. It's gotta be this one, right? It's gotta be this one, right? Ooh, that's ugly. Come on. Nope. That's all right. We got our sub ready again. Look at this. These guys are about to tag for the third time while Eric's been on the outside of the ring. That's what I was talking about. Sometimes with Hall, he kind of hogs the ring because he's constantly pinning people. Ooh, a one turn. One turn submission there. That's going to be a lot of row breakers. Come on. I, f I think I got the hot tag coming here. 
Oh, boo. Here comes the heal. We needed to get it finished before he got this. Dang. It. Oh, he didn't do it. What are you even doing? And how did how did I not get a how did I not get a tag turn there? How? How? Actually how? Unbelievable. And all these on the board, I can't break a single one of these. Can't break a single one of these. Give me my extra turn. Come on! Oh, and he tags out with the finish ready. Unbelievable. All right, he's ready to go. So, on round two, he's going to come in with the hot tag. Here, there's a lot of row break gems on the board. And there's, like, no black gems. I don't even know what we're doing here. Hot tag's going to be no good. We get one times four. We got to do 177 with the finisher. Ooh, look at that. We're going to get four rows in this one. Five. Bop! Sit down, son. Oh, I still didn't get him. 162 after it. That's enough, though. That's enough, though. And Eric didn't really take any damage here. So, like I said, nothing too, too flashy. But he gets the job done as a tag partner. And uh, I'm sure you can find a better partner for him or something. If you've got a black gem damage coach, that's going to do you wonders right there. But, uh, or a coach, uh, who is it? Who is the coach that lets you choose more any gems? Is it like Macho Man or Hogan? I can't remember. I don't have any of them. But if you could use that and then use Black Gem Damage Trainer instead of Titus, you'd be in there, guys. You will be in there. So, I don't know. Or, uh, and if you had, uh, Dude Love at 9K for that Black Gem Damage, you'd also get another gem from that. So, it could be a lot stronger than I have it if you have everything optimized, but... From right there, you see, he could get the job done, guys. So, I don't know. Let me know what you think about Eric with the hot tag down in the comments section below. And, uh, yeah, be on the lookout for more content every day, guys. Until next time, peace.